Hey everyone, and welcome to our channel. Today we will discuss the potential sale of MQ-9B remotely piloted aircraft to India. On February 1st, the U.S. State Department approved a possible foreign military sale to the government of India of MQ-9B remotely piloted aircraft and related equipment for an estimated cost of about $4 billion. The proposed sale will improve India's capability to meet current and future threats by enabling unmanned surveillance and reconnaissance patrols in sea lanes of operation. India has demonstrated a commitment to modernizing its military and will have no difficulty absorbing these articles and services into its armed forces. The Indian Navy has already leased two Sea Guardian systems. Key systems of the sale include 31 MQ-9B Sky Guardian aircraft with TPE-331 10GD engines. The Indian Navy will receive 15 units, while the remaining 16 will be distributed equally between the Indian Army and Air Force. MQ-9B remotely piloted aircraft systems, known as Sky Guardian, is meant for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance. With Sky Guardian, joint forces and civil authorities can securely integrate into civil airspace and fly over the horizon via satellite for up to 40-plus hours in all weather conditions. This allows for real-time situational awareness delivery anywhere, day or night. TP-33110 GD engine has a commonality with Hindustan Aeronautics Trainer Aircraft HTT-40 equipped with TP-33112B engine. The Hindustan Aeronautics Dornier 228 uses TPE-33110 GP-12JR engine. The main radar is Celex Sea Spray Active Electronically Scanned Array Surveillance Radars. This is likely the Leonardo Galileo Sea Spray 7500E or 7500V2 surveillance radar for land and maritime intelligence applications. Key systems included in the potential sale are 161 Embedded Global Positioning and Inertial Navigation Systems, 35L3 Rio Grande Communications Intelligence Sensor Suites, 170 AGM-114 are Hellfire Missiles for Anti-Armor Use and Range of Up to 11 km, 310 GBU-39B-B Laser Small Diameter Bombs and Extended Range All-Weather, Day or Night 250-Pound Class, Guided Munition, the notable support system included is KOR-24A Small Tactical Terminals. The Indian Navy MQ-9B Sea Guardian specific equipment includes ANSSQ-62F Sonobuy used for detecting and positioning of submarines in preparation for attack, ANSSQ-53G Sonobuys, which provide acoustic information at a fixed depth of 45 feet, ANSSQ-36 Sonobuy, which provides vertical temperature profiles of the ocean layer for research and ASW purposes. The principal contractor will be General Atomics Aeronautical Systems. India typically requests offsets. Any offset agreement will be defined in negotiations between India and the General Atomics Aeronautical Systems. Implementing this proposed sale will not require the assignment of additional U.S. government or contractor representatives to India. The approval by the State Department does not mean the deal is a sure thing. This sale requires U.S. Congress approval. India is under pressure from the U.S. to take action on the assassination attempt of Gurpatwan Singh Pannan, a U.S. national designated by India as a terrorist. You can find the video link at the end explaining the issue. India is the largest international operator of Boeing P-8 aircraft and possesses a sizable inventory of ISR platforms of U.S. origin such as the Sea Guardian MQ-9B. These two platforms might be piloted and integrated into the merged network to maximize the processing, exploitation, and distribution of intelligence for partner nation activities. Do you think U.S. Congress will block the sale in view of the Pan Nun incident? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this content, please subscribe to the channel and share and like the videos.